There is oftentimes a big debate between these two words and concepts. Manager, right? We always talk about managers versus leaders. Is it better to be a manager? Is it better to be a leader? And from my perspective, uh, this is becoming kind of a bad word. Even managers don't want to be managers. Managers don't want to be responsible for managing others and no employee wants to be managed. The language that we use inside of our organizations matters a lot. I actually remember when I was talking with Bob Chapman, the CEO of Barry Waymiller, and I actually used the word manager in there a couple times. And he legitimately got mad at me and he's like, Jacob, I don't want you to say the word manager anymore. We don't use the word manager inside of Barry Waymiller. And because he, like many other CEOs, understands that the way that we talk about these things matter. So I want to encourage you to think about how you can move away from manager to a leader. And as you'll see in the remainder of this course, it's not just a name change. It's not just a name change. It's a skill set change. It's a behavior change. It's a mindset change. But the language that we use to talk about these things matter. In fact, I don't even think we should be using the word manager ever. We should just get rid of this all together. That's it. No more. Everybody inside of an organization should be a leader. Now keep in mind, to be a leader, you don't have to be responsible for others. You can be someone who's leading yourself. A leader does not mean that you have to be in a position of power where you are overseeing others. You might be a leader who is just helping others. You're not necessarily in a management role. You're not an SVP or an EVP or a director. You're just an individual contributor, but you're a leader because you're helping guide others, you're coaching others, you're becoming that lighthouse that I talked about earlier, and you're also leading yourself. So let's not assume that just because you're a leader, it has to mean you have to have a leadership or a management title or a role. Not necessarily the case. It's more about mindset and skill set here. So again, I encourage you to think about just getting rid of the word manager altogether. Nobody wants to manage, nobody wants to be managed. Let's try to create organizations that are full of leaders instead.